Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at cattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw Sacagawea and her little baby Pomp. I take three fingers from the top in the middle and I put a dot. And from that dot, I'm going to draw a curved line to the left, come back to the dot, and a curved line to the right. I come back to the dot, and I draw a big curved line down on the left, and a big curved line down on the right. <clears throat> Excuse me. Come back to the left, and let's draw a curved line over, up, connect. I come on the right hand side and draw a curved line out on the right, connect, and a curved line out in, connect on the left. Right next to that space, I'm going to draw a dot, and from that dot, I'm going to draw a circle. Okay? I come back to the main part right here, and I'm going to draw more curve lines on the right. I'm going to come back and draw this down and this up connect. On the left, I'm going to draw more curve lines on the left. Connect this little line right here and add one more going down. I come back on the right hand side right about here and I'm going to draw a big curve line down and around and connect. And right here on the right hand side, I mean the left hand side, I'm going to do the same thing. Big curve line, down, connect. Okay. Come back to the little circle, and I'm going to draw a little curve line out, in, connect. And if you have room, little curve line out, in, connect. Come back here on the left, and if you have room, see if you can draw a little circle on the left and come on the right, draw a little circle on the right. Now come back on the left to the baby circle and we're just going to draw one, two, three little curved lines. Come on the inside, one, two, three little curved lines and maybe one, two little curved lines. Okay? Come back to this section on the left. We're going to draw a straight line down curve line up, keep going, and connect. Now on this space right where we stop we're going to draw a curve line down, curve line in, and connect. Come back over here to the left and we're going to draw a curve line up, curve line up, and let's do just a floater curve line. On the right hand side we're going to draw a curve line down on the inside of this space. Keep going. Okay? Now on the right hand side we're going to draw a wavy, wavy, wavy line down, wavy, wavy line down. If you have room you might want to put just a little wavy line right there. Okay? Come on the inside and let's draw one two little straight lines. Come back down below. Draw me one, two little dots. In the middle, straight line, curve line. Down below, curve line up, down, up, and stop. Come over to the little one over here and we're just going to draw one, two little slightly curved lines one, two, little dots, and curve line up, down, up, and that's it. Okay, let's see if that's everything. I think so. Okay, let's see how we're going to color this in. Okay, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to color my ears, my face, on Sacagawea and the baby, so that I can see where my lines are. Okay, so this should all be light brown or tan depending on what colors you have. Then 
I'm going to take a blue green and those little circles if you could fit them in I'm going to make these blue green so Sacagawea has on some earrings okay and that's kind of important because a little pop of color then I come in with my black crayon and I color in my hair on Sacagawea and this section right here this is also hair and this is hair this is her braid so color those in and if you got that little point right here you can and then on pomp the baby just add some black lines okay then on pomp's blanket I just mimic those lines with red and went over those with yellow just for a pop of another pop of color so it doesn't look all one shade and then I just took my brown crayon and this is Sacagawea's buckskin dress and I just colored that in brown now you can decorate this way more than I have but this gives you the general idea okay let's see what it looks like all colored in Here's Sacagawea with Baby Pomp all colored in. I know somebody's going to say, that's not how you spell Sacagawea. There's a ton of different spellings for her name. So I'm using the one that they Googled. Okay, bye-bye.